have you ever heard of the term friend poaching? <laughs> well, it describes what happens when you introduce two of your friends and they hit it off so well that now you're left out of their plans when they hang out together. <laughs> Licensed clinical psychologist Susanna E. Flores said, it almost feels like your friend is having an affair because a third person has entered the relationship. And then they end up excluding you from the friendship. And just like when someone cheats in a ro romantic relationship, you can end up feeling angry, sad, and rejected. Yes. Ladies, have you ever introduced two of your friends to each other? What? And then they start hanging out without including y'all? Yes. 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 And I love it. Oh. I love it. I'm not <laughs> going nowhere. So y'all can just kick it together. I love it. I, I love literally it. went to a birthday party the other day and imagine an entire table. And at some point my friend looked around and goes, oh my God, Adrian just hands off her friends to me. And I was like, what do you mean? She looked at the table, almost every person at the table she had met through me, yet they all hang out. And I pop in every once in a while, like, hey guys, hope everything's going well here, copacetic, you yes. know? That is literally but me. But you don't like I that, Garcelle. The... I don't like it. No? They're my friends, friends. Really? No. I, feel like, I don't yeah, like it when people are like, oh my God, you were so busy, we didn't think you'd be available. Ask me, I don't like that. You're like the meme that says, even if I don't want to, like, ask me. Even if I don't want to. And then go. let me tell you, I'm not coming. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> No, totally. No, I don't like that because then I feel like, well, you guys, I introduced you to. How can you leave me out? That's so wild. No, I don't I, care. I'm, you don't I'm care? Like, hey, just, oh, this I is care. so funny because just two days ago, I went to a birthday party. My girl, Chami, oldest friend here in, in LA, and she had a full room of a bunch of friends. And I was like, how do you know Chami? I didn't remember. How did you meet Chami? She was like, girl, we went to Stagecoach with you and you introduced us. Wait, how do you know Chami? You carpooled us with Chami in the back. I'm like, I'm amazing of a person. Yo. I walk. Yeah, it was Julissa's birthday. Julie goes, um, I'm friends with Drea because I met her through you. I'm friends with Tasha because yeah. I met her through you. Yeah. I'm friends with Luba because I met her through you. I'm like every like everyone at the table. Yeah. And I get was like, your oh, own friends. No, no. I love it. The friend. more the merrier. No, about it. <laughs> no. What was I gonna say about this? Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> no. Why are you even here? Are, yes. What are you? Are you? Are you no. joining us today? I cannot. I have. I have issues that I have to deal with. Like I become friends with somebody, mm -hmm. and then I have to deal with the best friend being jealous of me. Ooh. Oh. That's that is That's really really hard me. because I'm like. I'm not taking your friend from you. I'm like, I can't help because she that. called me and she want to go do stuff, the stuff that I like to do. And then the other friend gets jealous and everything. And you could tell they get jealous because they stop liking your pictures on Instagram. Oh, they damn. leave little remarks and comments but that's and everything. Damn. Mature men's Grown first women. Time. Garcelle, Grown. don't be that person. Yes, <laughs> but Why I do. Are you You guys look like you're having a good time. Okay. <laughs> but I like that you tease it and bring it up because if they hear you and they're like, oh dang, like she actually wants yeah. to be with yeah. us, that's different. Whereas my friends, like I'm too busy sometimes, honestly, and I can't join them and I don't want them to not hang out because I'm not no, there. I don't want them to hang so out. I'm like, go, go, Same. do your no. thing. But I feel and if you, they I... finally call me and say, hey, can you go with us? We're gonna go to brunch and I go, no, I can't. Yeah, I can't. Oh my God. But, no, but I least... actually think it's healthy communication to say it even if you're like, this yes. feels a little petty, say it because I think it's important for your friends to know the type of person you are. So just hit you with the text. Now I know. Now I know. Okay. I'll hit you with the text don't regardless. Don't leave me out, you I guys. You, okay, never. now before yes. we go on a break, don't forget our real remix contest is underway, you guys. We're calling on a real friend from across the country to sing our theme song and make it your own. Hey. All you have to do is post your version of our theme song on your public Instagram page, not your story, and follow and tag us at The Real Daytime with the hashtags, The Real Remix and Contest. For full contest rules, please head over to thereal.com.